that is approximately 45% of our base's power load. Uh, so that, that's coming from the methane gas that, you know, that goes into the turbines that then work a process that, that to create the energy for the base. Pumping methane out of the landfill and into a turbine-based power plant gives Marines a head start towards something they call energy security. The September blackout in 2011 gave them a glimpse. Now, the base didn't operate at the same level as it does now, but we do have backup generators that did allow us to maintain some of our critical infrastructures to uh, carry out uh, flight operations and communications on the base. Marine officials eventually want the whole base to have power in those situations. Miramar Energy Manager Mick Wasco says the methane plant is just one piece in the equation to be energy self-sufficient. It's to try and, try and produce what we use and use it on site and conserve as much as possible. The, the landscape is a huge effort towards conservation. And that's because energy use and water use are so closely related. Wasco says there's a lot more, including using the latest technology to track power use and making what's already here better. These tinting windows will essentially make it uh, thermally efficient around the building and make it so we use less air conditioning energy.